Hello YouTube, Freddy Cardona here. Welcome back to another video. If you lived in Saddlebrook, or if you currently live in Saddlebrook, I am on my way to feature your city. And it looks like we will be taking 62A. I featured other streets the most recent ones I featured were Pine Brook, New Jersey, Hackensack, some parts of Fairlawn, some parts of Teaneck. Remember to subscribe if you're a visitor. Thank you so much for joining me. Right now we're doing a driving tour of some sections of Saddlebrook. And as soon as I get the chance, I'm going to pull over, get my bearings, and continue the drive. Many of you will remember this iconic interchange here, coming off of Route 80, going into your town. So we're gonna take Midland Avenue to start. Just have to be careful navigating these turns. The right lane to keep right. I am listening to my navigator, Tom. That's my navigator's name. So swing around. You've got the Garden Plaza Hotel there. Let's see what else is we doing. It's asking me to go around to the right. As you can see, very impatient drivers honking. That's very normal when I do these drives. I'm gonna stop right here. In 1,000 feet, turn left onto New Pella Avenue. All right, let's see what we got here. We are currently on Pell Avenue. I got my hazard lights on. Some commentary, some organic sounds. We got Park 80 West there on the right, Marriott to the left. We're going to make a right hand turn here on New Pell Avenue. to the northern section of Saddlebrook. At some points in the drive, I may leave Saddlebrook temporarily. We're currently on North Midland Avenue going over the Garden State Parkway. Going past Moldner. To the left there, we have we have Elmwood Park. But we're still in Saddlebrook. And you got the UPS distribution center there on the right in this industrial park. There used to be a this is Zuckerberg's Industrial Park on the right. That's an iconic spot here in this area. And there used to be a restaurant here on somewhere here on the left. If anyone remembers, please let me know. You have the Midland Brew House there on the right. 
If I if I can recall the name of that restaurant, I'll let you know. You've got Cloverdale Cloverdale Park Apartments there on the right. And let's see what buses run through here. The 160 to Elmwood Park. Many of you know that have been following for a long time know that I like to call call out uh, buses that run through any specific streets that I might be driving on. I don't do it all the time, but I try to do it as much as I can. 339 regular cash, 343 regular credit, and 375 diesel it are the gasoline prices. I like to call those out as well for historical purposes. If you're watching this video 20 years from now, you're thinking, wow, gas prices were so cheap. Or you might be saying, wow, can't believe how expensive gas prices were in those days, especially if you have flying cars. You might be using diesel fuel for your flights. But um, you ever notice like in a lot of the older movies when they predict the, predict the future, there's always flying cars. But in reality, it hasn't happened yet. This is the more residential area. And we just crossed over, by the way. We just left Midland, uh, Saddlebrook. We're gonna try to get back on Saddle, into Saddlebrook here in a moment. And what we're gonna do is we're going to turn around. Get back to Midland. We're on Dorchester Road. I wanted to thank the Fred Scribers. We have over 2,570 subscribers as of this video. I think it's 2,573. We're trying to get to 3,000. So if you're enjoying the content, share this video with others, encourage them to subscribe. Get your boy Fred over to 3,000 subscribers. We're on our way back to, Mid North, to Saddlebrook. I was gonna say to Midland Ave. Right, we're headed back. All right, Wilson Street, and we're back in Saddlebrook. We're gonna to try to stick to the residential neighborhoods right now, instead of going back to Midland. I just saw a Fairlawn police car there on the left, but my navigator is telling me that I am in Saddlebrook. You let me know. Those of you that live in these neighborhoods are the experts. I'm just a visitor. Shepis Avenue. My previous Fairlawn video received a lot of positive comments when I showed the neighborhoods, the residential neighborhoods. A lot of folks were really appreciative that I was showing the neighborhoods where they grew up as we crossed Maple Ave. Still on Shepis, Skepis, S-C-H-E-P-I-S, crossing Spruce, and then Larch Avenue. See, if you lived on Larch Avenue, you didn't think anyone in YouTube would feature your street, but that's why you have to subscribe. You never know where I'm gonna be. You must subscribe to Freddy. You never know where he's gonna be, Jenny. Every now and then I will do my horrible Forrest Gump impression. For those of you that have heard my impressions, let me know your memories of my horrible impressions through the years as I do these drives. Still in Saddlebrook, Fairlawn Parkway is where we are. Crossing Floral Lane. You got the Hong Kong Chinese restaurant right there. We're gonna try to get to the Southern section. Look at that car with all the cherry blossom leaves on the windshield. Crossing 
Well, we're passing the Saddlebrook Auto Center. We're crossing Graham Terrace. We got a speed bump. Yeah, there we go. Still on Fairlawn Parkway. Now we're gonna make a left on Nedelik Road. Bumpy bumpage. Trying not to drive fast in these residential neighborhoods. You gotta take it easy, take it easy. We're making a left on Oxford Avenue. Passing Seal Ave or Skew. And we're gonna make a right on Saddle River Road. Another iconic road here in Saddlebrook. We're gonna head down to the southern section of Saddlebrook now. Again, I'm sorry if I didn't show your street. Saddle River Road does continue to the left as we cross Cambridge Ave. This is a, a iconic location here. We got the fire department here on our right. I forgot to see the house number on the right there. Crossing Daniel Court and Jamros Terrace. Crossing Bell Avenue. Let's see what buses go through here. We've got the 180, 164, 707, 758, and 144 to New York. We had somebody waiting at the bus stop there. I think I might have spooked her. I should have waited till, till I got to a different bus stop. She looked very spooked when I stopped there to read the, um, the buses, the buses that run through here. Rumpies, eat big, pizza, pasta, sliders. Oh, I gotta check that place out one day. Let's see, you got Tech Depot on the right. You got a dentist, George Melky, or George, George Melk, M-A-L-K-E. You got a bagel store called Bagel Run here on the right-hand side. Telephone number is 201-880-8811. Let them know if you are feel so inclined, give them a call. Let them know that Freddie Cardona just went past the establishment. You've got Carucci's Restaurant and Pub there on the right hand side. A bunch of stuff here in Saddlebrook. You've got St. Philip on the left. Man, I really do hope there's a bunch of Saddlebrookians or Saddlebrookites. If you lived in Saddlebrook, what, what, what is the nickname for the residents? Like if, from Patterson, where I'm from, it's Pattersonian. As we continue on Saddle River Road. Man, I'm still feeling bad about stopping at that bus stop. Orchard Lane. We just crossed Orchard Lane, that's what I meant to say. So I guess that Zuckerberg Industrial Center would qualify as the industrial section. Maybe I'll take a drive over there real quick to show you that section once we finish with the residential part. Hudson Bay Realty there on the left. Get back on uh, 
on Route 80, I want to show you the industrial park because I like to show the industrial area as well. Zuckerberg Industrial Park. So we're back on Route 80. It's going to be a little bit more congested since there are more cars. It's a little later in the morning. We're going to take exit 62 to get back and we can show you the Zuckerberg Industrial Park. It's the right lane to take exit 62, and it's the right lane to take the right to 7. And this is why people get into accidents, because these cars that were behind me, they, they clearly see my signal light, they know I want to turn, and instead of letting me go into the lane, they all speed up. We're back. I said Peel Avenue. I think it's Pele Avenue. The navigator is pronouncing it Pele. Doesn't mean it's right. I'm just saying it's pronouncing it Pele. Pele Avenue. Well, we're headed to the Zuckerberg Industrial Park. Slight right toward New Pele Avenue. New Pele. Yeah, Pele. It says Pele. Well, you guys let me know. You folks that lived in this area, you guys are the experts. And I'm going to meet you over once we get to the entrance of the industrial park. All right, we're, we are here at the Zuckerberg's Industrial Park. I'll try to call out some of the establishments that are here. You've got Argo, Argco Northeast, A-R-G-C-O. Ridgewood Closets. Who remembers Modern Family and the company named Closets, 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 Closets? You've got Greenbaum, Building K on the right. I wonder if they the color brown is being used because the UPS is one of the main hubs, one of the main establishments here. It's a UPS hub. Let's make a right over here. We're just showing you this industrial section here. I might end up at a dead end here. We've got direct embed coating systems. There on the left. Amerit, Amerit Technology, see a little van there. Target Specialty Products. Let's see what else we got here. Okay. So yeah, I'm wondering that maybe that's why everything's painted, like for the most part, brown. We got Bronze Express there on the right. I mean the truck right there in front of us. Best moving services. Directly in front of us, you see the bay doors with the UPS trucks. We got the Barber Salon Outlet. I guess they sell equipment for barber shops and salons. This is located at 300 North Midland Ave in Saddlebrook. We got Saddlebrook Controls there, a division of Ribble Company. Let me just show you the gate, uh, the UPS gate right there. That's the UPS gate. That's where all the trucks come in and out. <laughs> you 
you got Marcone right there on the left. And we're going to turn us around. through some of the buildings. Saddlebrook controls. And you gotta, I think this is another, this is like a UPS pickup. Let me see, where is it? Oh, up ahead. You got style Korean there on the right. And this looks like a UPS. Is this a customer pickup here? I don't know. If I can check, yeah, yep, customer center, customer counter, package pickup. Yep, so you can pick up your packages there. You've got Benny's educational toys there on the left. So, this is the industrial park. I'm sure Saddlebrook has other industrial areas, right? Raised Computer Floors Incorporated, RFS Commercial, but I would imagine this would be the main. The main one, the iconic one. Let me see if I can show you this sign. Oh, that's the north building there. Okay. All right, guys, we're gonna end the video here. The Saddlebrook video. And I guess this is the perfect ending right here. Have a safe, have a happy and safe day. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you on the next video.